Okay, kids, do you want the funny or the really funny? So the funny is that uh, this is take two. Uh, the really funny is it's not actually take two, it's take four. And I finally worked out how to do this level and what it wanted from me. It's mean it hides people outside of the map. We'll get into it in a minute. I finally worked it out. And I went, oh, and then I looked down at the timer in the bottom right of my desktop. And I'd actually been going for 45 minutes without making any progress. Uh, this game is mean. Um, uh, I'm just going to grab a drink from the side over here. And then I'll come back and uh, we'll read the briefing and I'll tell you how fucking mean this is. But just, just for clarity, there, there's a, a but you can't even see because we go off screen with how many save states we've got. As I went back and forth and jumped over platforms trying to work out what I was doing wrong. I wasn't doing anything wrong. The game is mean and uh, yeah. <laughs> right, give me a second. music it does mean you get to listen to this bitching music but uh, we'll read the briefing and I'll explain um, this is a, uh, a, a, a vehicle level I, th I, I um, basically but this is mean once I twigged what had happened um, I'm embarrassed it took me 40 minutes and several save states and reloads to understand but the last stand this is a proud moment Rock Raider the Explorer has been totally repaired and our energy crystal reserves are full and it's all thanks to you. I've ordered our mining teams to return to the ship and prepare for the long journey home. There's a problem though. Oh yes, there's a problem. One of the mining teams hasn't reported in and I fear they may be trapped somewhere. Can you go and find them? As always, time is short. The team were working from a base in the middle of a lava lake. Unfortunately, our scientists estimate that the lava levels are going to rise in a few minutes. You will game over due to underground earthquakes, and you don't want to be there when that happens. Once you've found all the team members, make your way to the nearest teleport pad. You'll need to find some energy crystals to power it, as all the ones on board are the, the being used to fuel the hyperdrive. So bronze is 10 and save all four scientists, silver is 10 and 6 and save all four scientists, and gold is 10 and 12 and save all five, four scientists, and that would be to do it in nine minutes. So like I said, 40 minutes in, I realized what was happening. Um, when when it says up here, um, their base is collapsed and they're, 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 they're uh, in the middle of the lake. What it actually means is they're out of bounds and you have to fly out and find them. So yeah, I, I'm embarrassed to say I've spent all, you know, 45 minutes <laughs> unable to find these scientists. So we're going to be Axel because he's a driver, or we could be Jet because she could jump, and we need to do jumping. But uh, needless to say, this is fucking mean. This is really mean, and once I realized what was happening, I slapped my head because it's an airlift mission. But they're, they are when they say the, their base is collapsed, they are out of bounds, and they're surrounded by rock monsters in these little tiny pockets that you can't see on the map, which is fucking mean. <laughs> and uh, I'm super, super angry. So we're not going to go for any... We're, well, we're, we're never getting gold medals. We're going to use the cheat codes if the cheat codes work to unlock everything. But... Oh my god. What the fuck? There's only four of them. And I found them all. But I found them all after like a lot of saving and loading and just flying around the map. Trial and error. And I can't 100% tell you where they are. Other than I think they're at the very top and at the very bottom. Uh, and they, they, they have rock monsters that are attacking you while you're doing it. But this is a bit of a bullshitty, um, a bullshitty level. But we're going to go. So it starts us out here. And we're going to jump and take a fuckload of damage and nearly die right at the start. So we're going to um, go again. <laughs> right off the bat. Made it that time. Huh. Didn't make it that time. Huh. Died. I don't know why I'm loading save state with this. Huh. You know why? It's because I'm not... Um, 
I'm not waiting for the... Ow. I'm waiting for the jump to charge up. I'm nearly dead. Please go away. Right. Now make the jump. <clears throat> Didn't make the jump. Nearly dead. <laughs> so you can see why I was saving and loading a lot. Um, I don't know why I'm doing anything. We haven't... We haven't save stated or anything. But that's 30 seconds just to do that. And all I'm doing is coming down here. So there's a whole path and a whole bunch of bullshit here. Didn't take any damage that time. Died straight away that time. Yeah. Some of these jumps are mean. Uh, yes, I do. My plan here is to make this jump, get that crystal, and then... Uh, No, it's it's because I'm not waiting for my jump to recharge, and I'm not playing as the chick with the jetpack. I was playing as the chick with the jetpack. I'm playing as Axel now, aren't I? All right. Wait for the jump to recharge. All right. Wait for the jump to recharge. Now save state. I should have stayed as the kid, the kid with the the chick with the jetpack, but. Uh, Whose name is Jet? I stood in front of a scorpion. Not my proudest. Not my proudest fap. I don't know what I was going with there, but okay. So over here is a big ass helipad, and the big ass helipad says you need ten for the tunnel transport. And yeah. In fact, we might just reload that save because we've made the jump. Right? It's this one, right? Ow! Stupid. Over here... ...is... ...bullshit. Wait for the jump to recharge. Don't know why I'm not waiting for the jump to recharge. <laughs> There is a pattern to my madness. I like how I'm getting shot every time I do that as well. That's like my jump has recharged. Get some health. Wait for the jump to recharge. Jump over here. And if you see over there, yeah, crystals down there. Also, people to rescue. That one is accessible. Right, jump is recharged. Big jump. Wait for that. Big jump. Oh, just took a fuckload of damage. Luckily, there's a heal here. Now, that over there is the rapid rider and the thingy, but we don't need that yet. Oh, I failed! Because I'm not waiting for my jump to recharge because I didn't check my barriers. Where am I? Yeah. Okay. It's pretty heartrending to keep screwing these jumps up, but we'll live. We don't need to go up there yet. Don't worry about it. There's nothing but pain up there anyway. <laughs> oh, this is the first time you've seen me literally redoing a mission. Oh, how do I make that jump and then walk in? Oh. Okay, so we're not going to worry about going up there yet, other than snagging the health. Instead, we're going to jump to here, then wait for the jump to recharge. Jump over here. Wait for the jump to recharge. Jump over here. See the laser? Fuck yeah, you see the laser. I should have had that on as well, but... Anyway. We're doing this to get ore. 
There's also a killdozer up here, which is... So this is a bit mean, because this is a redo. I think this is the first proper redo in the um, Let's Play, but I didn't realize... Look, this is as far as we can zoom out, kids, yeah? I didn't realize that the scientists... I was going all over this map watching the timer countdown. The scientists aren't here. You've seen most of the map, except for the base where we're going to get the airlifting thingy majiggity. And yeah, the scientists aren't here. They're, they're, they're to our north and to our south. Because this game is fucking mean. And it never specified, yo, they're out of bounds. It should have. So that's six. Seven. Eight. I might go and get the um, tunnel laser thing. I Yeah, we're not going for a gold medal or anything here. If anyone was wondering, we're just trying to do it. See that killdozer? I think there's... We need 10, so... There it is. Right, so now we've done that, we get this funking killdozer. We're doing all of this, by the way. Uh, we just needed the the materials that are there. We're doing this, which is stupid, to get crystals. There are four crystals here. Five. I think there are five. I think there's one to the right as well. But what we really came down here for was all that ore we just got. Just so careful driving the killdozer. Right. I don't remember if there's one to the right. I think there might be, because there's ten and ten. Yeah, there is. It's in the corner. It's very difficult to see because. Also, remember, if the dozer blade isn't facing... <laughs> it won't remove the spider webs. So that's everything up here. Okay. We've got all of that. So now... Who wants to do some precision platforming? Me, me, me. Right. That's why we safe stated. It's because I'm not waiting for my jump to recharge. Wait for your jump to recharge. Now I have to double check there's nothing down here. No, I knew there was nothing down there. We don't have time to spare here. We've wasted four minutes already. Closer to about 25 minutes, because I'm reloading save states constantly. We haven't got a gun. We will get a gun. So anyway, if you come over here... It looks like there should be somewhere there. There isn't. At this point, like me, you're wondering, well, where the fudge is the are the scientists? They're not in the map. They are literally not in the map. You cannot find the scientists. So you see this little tunnel thing here? Stop it. Thank you, spider. This little fucking tunnel thing is going to explode! This is the tunnel runner. I might actually save state this because it was hard enough getting this down here in the first place. Honestly, half the time I think it's better to just walk this because this thing controls so bad. Don't forget, you can only go back and forth. <laughs> I 
I promise you there's a reason we're doing this. This is where the base is. See that? But we don't want that yet. So, we load state. Where was the last save state? And we go down instead. Because we've got the 10 ore. Hopefully, we go over here. I did land in the lava and we built the thingamajig. Now, I don't know where these are, but where I was in that tunnel thing, right? That there is literally, here they are, here they are, you see them? There's a lava monster. So we have to try and airlift them out. But the lava mob. Right. You have to keep your eye out for the, the very difficult to see green arrows. If you know anything about me, you'll know. <laughs> see, it's easy now. Now I know. Um, if you know anything about me, you'll know. Uh, I can't see green. So over here is a lava monster and a landing pad. also a laser to kill lava monsters which I ran past and if you're conscious enough you will see that we've already wasted six minutes and we've got nothing to show for it so we have a jump to make here I missed the lava monster with the insta kill laser Twelve crystals. Oh god, he punched me into a thing. So that's the wrong one. Somewhere <laughs> around here, as I save it, because we're on six minutes forty-seven seconds. I know everything I need to do at this point, kids. I just don't know exactly where it is. Somewhere around here. That's him. Here we go. That's two. So that's seven, twelve, and four. And we need it's six, isn't it? We're on half health on our airship, by the way. Uh, we've got all of the... Um, Got all of the Lego men's. <sighs> so now we just need to find our way. So if that's there, I'm not trying to get a gold medal, by the way. I'm just trying to beat the level, and I've clearly had some trouble doing it. But the landing pad was down here. We've saved them, right? This is where I get confused. Because we don't have a lot of time now. We have about two minutes left. <sighs> Alright, so we do a run. Again, we've got one hit point left. So I can't whiff any of these jumps. <laughs> or even just walk off the edge. Jeez. Louise. That's the wrong save. Is it? That's the right save.
Because this isn't. That's a, a, a mining station. Right. I have to make every jump here. Perfectly. <laughs> so I think we might save state after every jump just because Jesus. mouse off screen out. We don't have a lot of time. We have two minutes. Oh, that guy's shooting at me and I've got one hit point so I should probably pay attention. Woof! Ha! Oh, some health there. And over here... Believe it or not. <laughs> oh, I cocked that up. Of course I cocked that up. <sighs> Over here. That was a fucking tragedy. Okay, I'm going to save it here. With this little tunnel raider thing. Alright. Let me go through here. And it explodes because God hates me. The very end, <laughs> this is where we were supposed to drive to. It's base. You made it. 10, 12, 4 saved. Congratulations, Rock Raider. Everyone's safely on board. And have been given the order to activate the hyperdrive. Uh, strap yourself in and relax, Rock Raider. We're going home. I, I, I promise you, I've totally been... <laughs> that's taken like an hour and a half now. But we did it. And somehow we got a gold medal. Uh, I'm actually kind of impressed with myself there. We didn't get all gold medals, but we got some gold medals. Uh, make a note of the password if you want to play along, as per usual. But we fixed the ship. You're proud of me, father. I preferred this style of Lego game. Unique IPs. And they talk like that. Hyperdrive activated. Off we go. Long overdue LP that was. Credits developed by Data Design Interactive. Executive producer, Stuart Green. Programming, head of programming, Todd... I'm not going to read these out, dude. Uh, mostly because this um, silent credits sequence is a bit epilepsy-inducing. So, apologies you didn't see the first playthrough, but I actually couldn't do it on my first playthrough because I didn't realise dudes were outside the map. I, I think the mission description was quite misleading. Uh, top secret software club testers, schools testing program, focus group testers. Additional thanks to Fatura. Um, and the credits just loop. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm really happy with that. We obviously didn't gold medal everything. If you'd have gold medaled everything, you'd have um, unlocked some stuff. But uh, we didn't. But that was the last stand. Um, we managed to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight gold medals. Um, 
Now, obviously, with save states and everything else, there's obviously I'd be able to get gold medals on all of these. But apart from the last stand, where I literally completely did not understand the, uh, the briefing, uh, we did pretty well. But I'm, I'm almost certain there's more. So if I just make my physical save... Because if we go back, uh, I don't know if you've seen.